your set? Uh, really, nothing to report. You know, uh, other than, you know, when we went into the game, guys that were not active, but uh, nothing to do with the game. Talk about the decision to try Jimmy there in the fourth quarter, John. Yeah, I think uh, at that point in time, you know, Jimmy's a uh, you know, rookie that's not played. Um, you know, the game was not going our way. Uh, I think he's, you know, a good young quarterback. Um, and give him some opportunities to get some reps. How do you think he responded to the opportunity? I think good. You know, I don't think we were good enough offensively today. I think that was evident. Um, you know, we had opportunities. We had drops. We had misses. Um, you know, that was the difference in the score. You're not going to win your share of games in this league score seven points. Coach, what positives can you take from this game moving into next week in Cincinnati? I think, uh, you know, fresh off a loss, I don't think there's many positives. I'm not sitting in here bubbling with all kinds of positives. Uh, you know, after looking at the tape, I think it's a little early right now to look at the positives. Uh, I know it was 20 to 7, and we'll be back to the drawing board as early as 6 a.m. in the morning and, and then try to look for positives. John, who starts at quarterback? Again, uh, yeah, it's way too early. I think right now, um, you know, I don't think, um, you know, I can make that decision at this point. You know, I don't think Matt's been benched by any stretch yet. You know, we'll start whoever gives us the best chance to win next week. And that'll take some time. John, it seemed like the timing was off a little bit in the passing game. You mentioned kind of opportunity for a couple big plays. Uh, the, the pass to Rosario, uh, and that, that one in particular. I, you know, I think uh, that's not a, a new story. Down there at the goal line in the fourth quarter when Clawson led them down there. Second and goal, third and goal. Your two first round draft pick running backs were sitting on the bench and you're going with Goodson and you have run the ball twice. What was the philosophy behind that decision? Um, who was it on the fourth and one that we didn't get? No, I understand that. But the second second down, third down. When you I don't remember it. those as well as I remember that fourth down. That we didn't get. Right. Yeah. But I was just trying to figure out what's or what's what was the what was the thinking, or why would? Well, I think people? 33 was in there quite a bit in that drive. I think made a lot of big plays in that drive to get us down there. So he was part of the guy. He's in on certain substitution groups. I think that was fairly evident throughout the game when we were in three wide offense. No, I said, but when you just, I was just trying to figure out the whole situation with that. With Cause I think it's done by personnel. Would be the answer to your question. Do you feel Jimmy provided a spark for you? today out there? Um, he moved the team the little bit he was in there and you know, a couple times didn't. So I think the one time that he did move the team, I think Matt moved the team today. You know, unfortunately, we didn't get a, you know, as many points on the uh, board as we'd like. John, what would you say the identity of this team is right now? Um, you know, it's hard to say. You know, I think we're young. I think we're um, you know, not that we lit it up on defense today. We, we made some errors there. Their quarterback made a lot of big plays off of scrambles. Uh, you know, he creates those things on his own. Um, you know, uh, as far as offensively, you know, I think we're capable of running the ball, just not consistent enough. And uh, we have people open. We just don't get, seem to get uh, the results. Um, that's what I saw today. So in a short two-game uh, look, I think uh, I can't answer that yet after two games. Why, why did you go with David Geddes, um, a line of receiver? Last week you had him in Nashville, but this week uh, you know he has some ability, but he, he was in on a lot of crucial plays. Yeah, we're, we're trying to find out who can play. Uh, to really answer your question, uh, mm -hmm. LaFell had a little bit of a uh, hamstring issue last week, didn't get as much playing time. They're both rookies. David Geddes is a guy that we like, and um, you know, without looking at the tape, I think you know he made some plays today. So uh, uh, we're still looking uh, for that wide receiver spot. So how about Dwayne? You know, Dwayne played. Uh, he had a role. Um, you know, we only had three receivers dressed for the game, uh, so those were the three. They all played. Anything on um, Smitty? It just looked like it told him to see Smith on the last play. It looked like he came up holding his arm and pointing to it. Does he I think he it? got, you know, bumped in the arm. Uh, you know, he's coming off of a broken arm. So I think uh, uh, there's no issues with it, though. Who surprised the offensive line the last two games? 
has been suspect. I guess would be a right term. And you know, the quarterbacks have had issues being protected. A lot of them. I mean, I know Stewart had a nice game, but D'Angelo Williams and some of the other. I mean, it just seems like the offensive line hasn't been to what it was maybe last year. I haven't felt that as much as you obviously have. Anything else?